Uh, we're trying to find a more economic way of capturing the carbon dioxide from the flue gas from coal-fired power plants. The reason why we're doing this is that we're going to have to depend on fossil energy for some time into the future. Using fossil energy results in carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, which can result in climate change. If we can uh, capture the CO2 economically, then there's a big demand for high pressure, clean CO2 for enhanced oil recovery. But the trick is how can we capture this CO2 in flue gas that's only like 13% CO2 and it's one atmosphere. So DOE uh, asked the, the academic uh, and industry community to figure out what are some new innovative ways to address this CO2 release problem from coal-fired power plants. And if you can come up with the technology to reduce even just a little bit, then you will address the problem in a real meaningful way. Because right now, there is no way to take care of the CO2 that's coming out of these coal-fired power plants. So we have a tank of uh, CO2 and nitrogen mixture here. And we flow that through uh, various controllers in our, to our system, which comes through and then is introduced into our solution here, which is designed to absorb the CO2 and the exit stream coming off is essentially CO2 free at this point. And then from there, uh, what we're able to do then is with the solution with the captured CO2, we can then take it somewhere else and desorb it and reclaim the CO2 for later usage. So the bubbler that we just saw, it's great, but it's a batch process. So you can use the absorbent only once. And so the next step for us is to use this novel material called a ceramic foam. The idea behind this is that using this, we will build a combined absorber and desorber unit, which then can, op can be operated as a continuous process. So you put the abs absorbent solution in, it removes the CO2, and then you regenerate the absorbent solution. So thereby, it becomes a continuous process, and it's a lot more economical to work with. We just can't keep using electricity from coal-fired power plants and still be happy with the CO2 being released into the atmosphere.